What is Google Jamboard? Google Jamboard is a digital whiteboard app that we have available to us in AACPS. Like our other Google applications, we create Jamboards by going through Google Drive. To do this, go to Drive and go to the new button in the upper left-hand corner. From here, select More and then select Jamboard. Just like our other Google applications, Jamboards will save automatically for us. So it's important to go into the upper, upper left-hand corner and go ahead and give that Jamboard a name. You will notice that it's a very simple interface. There aren't a whole lot of tools over here on the left or a whole lot of menu options. This makes it ideal for teaching uh, students live using this in Google Meet. There aren't a whole lot of distractions. In the upper right hand corner of the screen, you'll notice that you will have the option to open on a Jamboard. Please note that this is not available for our AACPS uh, employees, students, or teachers since we do not have Jamboards in our district. You can go ahead and hit the share button and just like any other application in Google, you can share a Jamboard with individual uh, teachers or you can change the link so that anyone in AACPS with the link can view or edit the file. This is a great option if you plan on using Jamboard Live with students in a Google Meet. You can simply change this link to make um, that all students would be able to edit the file, and then you can copy the link and drop it into the chat of Google Meet. If you want to see what your students have done after you've shared it, you can use version history. To get to version history in Jamboard, go to the three vertical dots in the upper right hand corner. You'll see version history is the last option in the menu. This will then open a toolbar over on the right hand side where it lists the date that uh, changes have been made to the Jamboard. If you see a little black arrow, that means you can expand that section and see uh, the changes done in more detail. This will then show you who has edited that particular Jamboard and at what time. You can also click to see what those changes were. If you want to restore to a previous version, you have that option in the upper left hand corner.